Recently I was at a meeting at a studio I teach at. The meeting mostly focused on a few new policies we're going to be implementing for the fall semester. But at the end of the meeting, the school director brought up the results of a survey he had given the parents of the students. One of the questions had to do with what parents wanted the students to get out of lessons. Unfortunately, this was set up in an extremely leading way that led to predictable answers that didn't really dig deep into what parents actually wanted. Instead of making it an open-ended question, it was a multiple choice set with various answers like learn to read music and play a song or jam. At the bottom, they had the answer have fun. The school director claimed that every single person circled this answer, maybe with some others as well. From that point on, the director talked in depth about making sure that the students were having fun, but in a very keep the customer happy kind of way. We have to keep them coming to lessons. It doesn't matter what they're learning as long as they're having fun. This is troubling on many levels, but mostly because music is not fun. Music is a joy. When one is making music, it is never random. The act of hitting the drums may be fun, but it's not music until one applies their sense of rhythm to their hands. Hitting random notes on a keyboard may be fun, but it doesn't become music until one applies their sense of melody and harmony, no matter how rudimentary or advanced. It comes easy to some and harder to others, but music is not made without some deeper hard-fought work, and no matter how easy or hard it is for the individual to improve, the more they put into it, the more they get out of it. This certainly doesn't mean that I am a hard disciplinarian when I'm teaching lessons by any stretch of the imagination, but keeping the student challenged and working hard is a key concern. When one feels accomplishment, it brings with it a sense of ownership and identity that goes much deeper than a mere fun activity. When music lessons are treated this way, like a mere fun activity, well, like most fun things, eventually the fun fades and it becomes boring. Something to do to pass the time here or there. However, if music is treated like a joy, something to work for and with, it becomes a deep part of that student's identity and something that will bring them joy for the rest of their lives. So, don't make lessons fun. Make them a joy. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe, all that stuff. Let's hit it.